Welcome back to Quick Wins with Com. I was just having a really interesting conversation about the shoe shining guy behind me. And I asked him, hey, can you clean my shoes? Even though they're brand new, and I thought, he says, no, I can't clean those type of shoes. And then I asked him, well, how busy are you? Because, you know, I'm just looking at people's shoes and there's no, not many other shoes as they were in the past. And he's been here for over five years he's been for. He says the business is starting to decline quite a lot. Two factors for that. One, the cold. And two, uh, people's type of shoes are changing. And it made me kind of think, like, if, if in a market today where products and services are consistently changing, are we keeping up our business? I mean, is our business keeping up where it needs to be? So as you can see, he does have someone. So the right avatar is sitting on the seat. That's right. He's got leather shoes. He's got a jacket so he's warm. So here we are. This is what we call now a client. The client straight away here. That's the right avatar. So out of all the millions of people here, we found the one. Because that person knew exactly that he wanted his shoes shined. So it's really making sure that you know where your avatar and you know what their weak points are. You know what their pain points are, most importantly. So my advice is, when he's sitting up there, getting his shoes shined, ask questions now. Question one will be, why did you come to my store for in the first place? Question two would be, do you like my product and service? Do you like my service? Question three is, would you recommend this to my friends, yes or no? Question four, is it convenient for you? Question five, how many times are you gonna be coming to my service ongoing? And then six, how could I improve my product and service offering? If you can't improve your product and service offering, you're just gonna stay stale in the marketplace. And yeah, you might get one client, but it's not the millions of people that are here. What do these people need and how can we service them better? What type of shoes are they wearing and what can we do for them? Is it new laces? Is it getting the dirt off? Is it making the soles a bit cleaner? Like what do they actually need? But then making sure once you have that information, mark it correctly. So making sure that you put a sign up there. We also clean black shoes, leather shoes, runner shoes so people know that this is the right place for them. So with that information, you can create one, better products, two, market much better. And that means that you're gonna get all these clients around here as your avatar. The right client is your avatar. So I hope that's helped in another episode of Quick Wins with Com. And remember, it's about always just checking in with your clients. It's about looking with your clients and starting to decide, do I need to innovate my products and services to make sure that I can market much better. I'll see you next time.